Hi everyone, it's Donna here from Donna's Creative Corner and today I have more of the vintage and antique um, laces for you. If you've been watching me in the last couple of um, couple of weeks, I've been offering some um, vintage laces and trims that I purchased at an estate sale recently and in that box there were quite a few pieces that were shorter, uh, like less than a yard. So I figured the best way to do to sell those would be into to do it in like small bundles. So that's what I have for you today. I only have four of them. Each one is ten dollars um, plus shipping. Uh, that's uh, plus shipping. And I'm going to get started here. Bundle number one is a can has a 24 this is 24 inch piece of this beautiful um, I believe this is Valencian lace I'm going to come in close so you can see the detail on all, on all of these they are gorgeous um, this one is about one and a half inches wide look at the detail it has the um, the like the net background and the little overlay stitching so there's 24 inches of that there's a piece of, I believe, yeah, I believe this is crochet. This is three and a half inches wide. There is, it looks to be in pretty good condition. I see one spot right there, an age, uh, some age discoloration. Um, this one is 22 inches long. Very pretty. That's in bundle one. Also in bundle one is another um, crocheted piece. Whoops, I guess it would help if I put it in frame, huh? Um, this one is 15 inches long and it's one inch wide. It's a pretty cream color. <laughs> I'm looking up on the screen and it looks almost looks like a bunch of swastikas. Um, but that's the pattern in it. That's a short piece of that. There's some, um, this gorgeous piece of, I, I guess this is crochet, I don't see the, um, the ends are finished so I'm not sure, but um, this one is 34 inches long, so it's almost a yard of this one. There is a little bit of discoloration in some spots. That's a little bit darker there, but overall it's a very pretty pattern. That's folded under there. It's in really good shape. So that's in bundle one. Also in bundle one is, I believe this is a, a bobbin lace. Very, very delicate. Look at the detail in that. I believe this is a bobbin lace, I'm not sure. Um, this one is 27 inches long and it's one inch wide and it's like an off-white. So that's in bundle one. Another, this one is quite old. It has, I'm not sure if that's crochet along the bottom, but some lace along the top. And Donnie, correct me if I'm wrong, those look like turtles, turtle lace going across the top. I learned that from watching Donnie Hall's um, lace videos. Um, let's see, this one is 30 inches long and it is one and a quarter inches wide. And I believe, yeah, there's a, a little bit of age discoloration there. Um, a little bit of um, some jagged edges at the top a little bit. This might have been removed from something, from a garment at some point. I'm sure this one is quite old. So that's in bundle one. Also in bundle one is this really delicate, um, delicate lace. It's a cream. It is three quarters of an inch wide. And that's a pattern. This one is in really good condition. 
and this is 44 inches long. This one is longer than uh, more than a yard as well. There's a few pieces in these bundles that are uh, more than a yard, but n not many. And also in bundle one, I'm going to include this incredibly delicate little doily. There was some lace in this bundle that was very similar to this. Look how delicate that is and how detailed. Look at that. Incredible work there. Um, this piece measures about nine inches by about four inches. So that was bundle number one. Bundle number two starts off with this so feather light delicate lace. I'm sh I'm pretty sure this one is antique. It is. It looks like a Valencian lace. I'm going to come in uh, so you can see the detail on it. It has some over stitches going around here that are in white, and the rest of it is that gorgeous, almost tea stained color. Very light, very soft, feather light. Um, this is three and a quarters inches wide and there's 29 inches um, in the length on this one. So there's a good good amount on that one. This one um, I believe is a bobbin lace or maybe it's crocheted. Well, it's got a bunch of edges coming off here so it's probably bobbin. Um, I believe this one was called a Clooney. Um, it is 26 inches long and three quarters inch wide, and that's and it's a uh, like a beige, beige almost tea stain color as well. These laces are perfect for your vintage, um, vintage albums. Here is another. I believe it's a Valencian lace as well. Very, very delicate. I believe this one might is probably antique as well. Um, it is 35 inches long, so there's almost a yard of it, and it's two inches wide. And there are some um, areas of it. This one is kind of tattered. I'm going to go along so you can see that the top edge. It may have been removed from something at some point. The top edge is quite tattered. And there's a little bit of age discoloration. Um, but not much. That's in bundle two. Here's another um, kind of unusual pattern in this one. Kind of a, a zigzag pattern. You can see the, the detail in the in the work there. Gorgeous. Um, this one is 31 inches long and it's one and a quarter inch uh, wide and it's kind of a cream cream color. Bundle number two has a nice length of let me get it straightened out here of tatting. One single strand. There is some like right there there's a little bit of discoloration. There's another piece there. I'm sure this is very old, uh, definitely vintage. Pretty pattern of, of tatting. I can just I can't even imagine how something like this so delicate was made. It's only about a I think it's mm, not even a quarter of an inch wide, I don't think. Um, this is 48 inches long, so you've got a, a good length of it. That's um, to the tatting in bundle two. This one is a white. Um, this one may be a bobbin lace as well. It is 28 inches long and it's about two inches wide. And that's the pattern in it. Very pretty. Come on. 
so you can see it, the pattern a little better. That's in bundle two. Also in bundle two is an insertion piece. Um, it is like an eyelet, eyelet and embroidered piece. Um, the edges are raw, and of course there's there the strings are coming off of it. Um, this is 24 inches long and one and a half inches wide. And that's the pattern in that. This is a white or just off-white maybe. And then lastly in bundle number two there are two incredibly delicate little butterflies. You have a larger one that is come on. this one is about five and a quarter inches by a couple of inches and then a smaller one that's about three inches by like one and a half one and three quarters those are adorable get that these are like a a dark beige almost a coffee stain color. So that's bundle number two. Bundle number three has this large piece of large widthwise. Um, it is 20 inches long by about four inches wide. It is a white and this is what it looks like close up you have these dimensional pieces with with like heavy stitching in them to give them dimension got the netting that's the first piece in bundle three second piece in bundle three is a, uh, I'm not sure if this is crochet or a, a bobbin lace. It appears to be very old. Um, it is 39 inches long, so there's a little a uh, bit more than a yard of this one. It's kind of a cream, oops, too close. Kind of a cream color. There's about an, um, about an inch, maybe a little bit more than an inch wide. Very pretty. So you got a good length of that. Um, this one, I'm not quite sure what type of lace this is. Um, it may be a bobbin lace as well, because the end has all different um, strings coming off of it. This one is a fairly short piece. It is 18 inches long by about 3 inches wide. Very detailed. That's the pattern. That's in bundle 3. Uh, next piece I believe is a Valencian lace. It is a pretty tea stain color 27 inches wide long by about 2 inches wide very pretty pattern um, I saw I don't know if this is a, a flaw or if it's just folded over but it looks a little irregular in there but other than that it's in great condition I love these I love these so much history um, also in bundle three is this piece of, I, I don't know if this is crocheted or, I'm not sure. Um, it is 31 inches long by one and a half inches wide. Um, there are some flaws in this piece. There's some um, rough edges. Mm, that might be the only one. Yeah, that was it. That's the only flaw I see in this one. So that's in bundle number three. We have a piece of this white. 
I'll be, I ordered a book from Amazon on vintage laces and linens to help me identify what these some of these are. It hasn't gotten here yet, so <laughs> I can't look at look these up because I don't know what this one is either. It has some really heavy stitching, so I I, I don't know what kind of lace this is, but it's pretty. It is. Let me see, 28 inches long, and it's about an inch wide, and it's in really good condition. And the last lace in bundle number three is really delicate little, I believe this is a bobbin lace, 16 inches long by about three quarters of an inch wide. It's very 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 delicate very intricate gorgeous and then lastly in bundle number three is also a pair of butterflies the larger one and the smaller one that uh, is the same that was it excuse me in bundle number two that was bundle three and bundle number four is all small delicate lace <coughs> laces um, they are three quarters of an inch or under. Oh, this one might be an inch. There's one in here that's an inch. There are a total of 14 yards in here. Uh, there's different lengths of, of each one. Um, this one is, is a cream. There's two and a half yards of that one. This one, there's only a half a yard. Very delicate pattern in that. This one is a yard and a half. Let's see if I can get my finger under there to, sh to show you. I don't want to undo all of these or I'll be I'll be in trouble. Look how delicate that is. Let me see if I can come in closer without getting blurry. There we go. So there's the pattern in that one. This one is one yard. See that delicate pattern? This one is two yards. Oh, I guess I'm going to have to do it. You see that? Gorgeous. This one is incredibly tiny. And there's three yards of this one. Look at that. It's. I don't think it's even a quarter of a quarter of an inch wide. And then you've got this cream one here. Similar to the one up here, but it's it's a double edge. Looks almost like a tape lace. And then lastly is kind of a seam seam binding lace in a dark coffee color right there. So there's 14 total yards in this bundle um, and I'm asking $10 for this one as well. Um, if you are interested in any of these bundles, as always, the instructions on how to order are in the description box below and I will mark things as sold as they sell. First come, first serve. Um, these are perfect for your vintage projects. Uh, that's all I have for today. Bye for now.